We got a best of five. I want to make some adjustments here at the beginning of the game. A couple things I need to change. We'll get the scoreboard all set. Nico will be the first to strike. It's a demo, earns himself an open net. This is not Hoops, Nico. This is an EU player who made his first RLCS last season. And actually, Nico is um, hes a younger player. I think he is still 15, maybe turning 16 soon, or maybe already is. Uh, but he is a, a, a very uh, motivated individual. He's been doing a lot of grinding in the Ones Arena. Sent me some uh, some messages talking about you know, his desire to get into some show matches. Feels confident in his ability lately. Has been climbing quite a bit. And Mozzarella is actually, um, you know, I don't, I don't, I haven't communicated as much with him, but he's very similar. He's a younger, a younger talent, a newer talent. But definitely someone that I would keep my eyes on. And he's French. We know the history of the French players is uh, very successful. Quick turn from Mozzarella right there in the middle of the field. We'll get him his first goal. Okay, camera. You know, give us an adjustment there. We just sat there looking at nothing. Three minutes ago, a very, I mean, honestly, a pretty low scoring ones game thus far. Nico with a couple early ones to start things off, but both players doing a good job on defense. Oh, okay. I jinxed it. I jinxed it. As I was complimenting the defense, we've got. A little mistake there from Nico. We're all tied up at two. Mozzarella with another possession. Look at the 50 game. Great recovery from Nico. In fact, he's going to secure the corner boost as well. And he'll head the other way. Both players making use of the low 50, keeping things safe. A tussle for possession there in the middle of the field, but Mozzarella comes away with it. Another low 50, but Nico positions well although mozzarella will find the demo now he's got a third Nico operating on very low boost. There's another 50. Mozzarella just buying himself some space here from the right wall. This time he absorbs that challenge. 
poor, uh, you know, low 50s. These guys are not really playing for an outplay. Uh, you know, they're not trying to flick over their opponent. They're not trying to put it past their opponent. They're just taking the challenge. Now, here's an outplay opportunity. Mozzarella off the ceiling. Can't get it past Nico. And now Nico with the counterattack. Actually rolled it too slow. So Mozzarella makes the first save, but Nico has another chance. 50 seconds left. Oh, that's nice. Set the flip reset up to perfection. Fakes it and finds the opening underneath. Well done. By Nico. Tie ball game. Final 45 seconds. There's another low 50 attempt from Mozzarella. Both players choosing to be extremely cautious. Another cautious decision by Nico. Turns his back to the play. He's rewarded with a midfield boost and an early flick to outplay the opponent. Nico gets his fifth. And that will most likely secure game number one. Game one goes to Nico. Game. Very grounded. As I mentioned while we're playing. Both guys. Making use uh, of the low 50 game. This time Mozzarella will strike first. It's a great possession for Mozzarella. Nico just very aggressive with his turn. He probably got tired of defending, to be honest. Mozzarella just held on to possession, continued to fling shots at the target. Nico, despite being low boost, faces the play and instantly challenges. Works out quite well. He gets his first. He'll get possession on the following kickoff. More safe plays. You see the, the, the slow play in the corner. These choices minimize the downside of his position. And now he's got the free counterattack from deep. Nico, it's no surprise that we're seeing a more, as I said earlier, risk-averse style. We're seeing a, a safer, a cautious style. Um... It's no surprise. As I said, Nico has been on the grind. He's been climbing in, in MMR. And I think this style in ones is, uh, you know, it's just a good approach. Great recovery for Mozzarella. Keeps the first shot out. Sends the second one to the side. And with that beat right there, he should be getting a third. He collects it towards the center and walks it home. Mozzarella back on top. Whoa, the double fake. <laughs> Both players with the same idea there.
Mozzarella, lots of power on the shot. Just a big time clear from his own end. Caught Nico a bit too far in the corner. But a quick response. We'll give Nico a third. We got just under three minutes to play. Mozzarella, lots of space. Goes up high. Again, kind of a safer option. <laughs> He's actually going to pool shot Nico into a fourth goal. Once again, Mozzarella just trying to absorb that challenge, even in the air. It's an all-in play for Mozzarella. And that's tough. If you don't succeed, he's way out of position. Nico doing such a good job of defending. Mozzarella knows Nico's going to waste the time on the goal line if he doesn't hustle back. These kinds of things, you know, it's little, it's little, uh, little mind games, I guess. They certainly start to wear on your opponent, begin to frustrate them. Mozzarella goes high this time. He's got a reset to work with. And he puts it to the top left corner. A little help from Nico this time. But just under two minutes to play. And we're tied up once again. Soft touch. Let's tap it over the top of Mozzarella, but it's off target, so Mozzarella will take possession. Nico with a, just a hard read there. I mean, he knew exactly what Mozzarella's plan was. Wow. That was really impressive. Nico was up before Mozzarella had ever double jumped to pull that into an air dribble. We got just under a minute 30. Mozzarella just really struggling to deal with the style that Nico's playing. Wow. Look at that. Nico up quick. From the ceiling, just a slight flick over the top of Mozzarella. Gives him an eighth. There's a nice play. Might be exactly what Mozzarella needs to get things started. He finds that bottom left corner as soon as he sees Nico launch from the wall. He knows how to outplay. Nico gets a ninth, and that should secure game two for Nico as well. Great defense. 
Mozzarella with an air dribble bump attempt. Not going to work. There's one. Mozzarella's early flick is good for a seventh. Nico wasted some precious time off the clock there. So there's only 14 seconds left for Mozzarella to work with. And that should do it. Nico just needs one extra touch. And that's it for game two. Nico looking for a sweep. Nico must be feeling pretty confident. After the first couple games. Shot to the far side. Blocked away by Mozzarella. Now that is... That is impressive. Low boost. Quick turn. Small catch. And a small flick, but it's good to go over the top. Nico will grab the lead early this time. Early challenge from Mozzarella. Read well by Nico. Gets his second. And just looks... I mean, Nico looks in form today. Good setup for Mozzarella, and the flick to the top shelf is good. It's actually off the crossbar and down, but he's there for the tap-in. Maybe this can get the engine started for Mozzarella. Nico, demo, easy collection. He gets a third goal. There it is, mozzarella. After working on Nico in the defensive side for a minute, finally gets a shot to the top shelf. Oh! I think we lagged. Controller's breaking. Oh, no. That's no good. I don't know if maybe he has another controller or maybe another cable or something. Mm 
We'll restart from kickoff. All right. Good sportsmanship here from Nico. Throwing a possession to Mozzarella. And an early flick is good. Uh, Mozzarella would have had possession is why Nico did that. He would have had possession pulling it up the wall. But obviously, the controller DC. A booming clear from Nico. Oh my goodness. Where did this power come from? Wow, I mean, he just struck it perfectly. I thought Mozzarella was surely back far enough where he would not be, uh, you know, not be in trouble. But the power clear from Nico is good. There's a mistake from Nico, who spawns at the perfect time. So Mozzarella has boost in the tank. Maybe a scoring opportunity. Oh, Nico, another mistake in defense. It's cost him a goal this time. Nico's delay kickoff. Countered. By Mozzarella, who just powers straight through the ball. There was actually no dodge. See, it just single neutral jump. Straight ahead. Nico should have a possession here. Shot to the near post. Blocked away. Uh-oh. Not a very good read from Nico, but... Everything settles as both players step back to their own corners. That's twice now. Mozzarella has full sight on Nico, sees him approaching from the side, and times the flick to perfection. Mozzarella up two. Wow. That was clean. I actually wasn't sure if Nico even got the reset. Kept it so controlled. Very well done. He's back within one. 95 seconds to play. There's a fake kickoff from Mozzarella, but does not get his corner boost. He is in a very difficult spot now. Nico's shot is on target. Mozzarella's had both corners stolen. He's stuck on zero. And he's done an adequate job with defending, but... When you got zero boost in the tank, it's so hard to keep your opponent out. Nico will punch one across the finish line. And now he's tied things up. Drive challenge from Nico. Forces an early jump out of Mozzarella. Oh, no. Mistouch on the wall. Nico going to hand over possession and mozzarella will absolutely take the freebie Smart play for Mozzarella. That is off target, but he doesn't need to score again. He just needs to make sure that he doesn't give Nico an easy opportunity the other direction. And that is what he's doing. He's securing these corner boosts, making life difficult for Nico.
And that will most likely secure the first game win for Mozzarella. Eco, double reset. Blocked away. So Mozzarella denies the sweep. Nico unable to find the back of the net. He will collect the clear. Try again. Slow things down into a regular dribble. Looks for air dribble bump. He's done well to maintain possession, actually. Mozzarella, good position. Lines up the double, and he buries it. And Mozzarella has just really turned things around after the controller DC. Maybe he swapped a maybe he swapped a cable or something. And that's allowed him to put together a better game. He's been much better since that moment. Nico, however, will respond. Quick turn in the corner. And he just finds the near post. Nico. Clear from the sidewall. Gets it over the top of Mozzarella. And he has a straightaway shot towards the target. He gets his second. 310 to play. Another uh, low 50. Mozzarella, and this time he will force it through. Nico will wrestle his way to an open, an open look there. Been a back and forth series. Nico jumps early to show the pre jump, but he did well to hold on to his boost, came back down to the ground. Great control from Mozzarella. Hoping for the bump. Not needed. 
that final touch. We'll push it to the far side of the target. This is just incredible, man. Look at that control. Mozzarella takes Elite. Scuffle here in the corner. Mozzarella is going to come away with possession. A good recovery for Nico. We'll keep the score line at 4 3, but Mozzarella regains possession, sends a shot towards the top shelf. But Nico will pinch it off the crossbar and send it away. Mozzarella, full tango boost. Has the reset, looks to go low, but once again, Nico slams the door shut. Great read, Mozzarella straight on target. He knew that Nico was not really going to be able to change much about that play. From his position, he no longer had the dodge, couldn't flick it past the challenge. Oh, that's not a very good kickoff, though. Mozzarella got underneath the ball. Not sure why he didn't jump there. Time to perfection. Nico grabs the flip reset. And couldn't wait a moment longer. Mozzarella dives early. But Nico with the perfect touch to send it over the top. We've got 56 seconds to play. It's a better kickoff for Mozzarella. That shot's lacking power, though. It's a turnover of possession. Nico, full tank of boost. What does he do? He wants to control, th slow things down and control the game. It looks like that was the correct decision. He secures the corner boost. Or was it? Mozzarella. What a quick turn there. I really didn't think that he would be able to get to this with zero boost, but he did. He did. We've got 36 seconds to play. And Mozzarella grabbed the lead. But Nico. Shows a kickoff strategy, the delay kickoff. He just kills it right there in the middle. Earns himself a sixth. <laughs> Both players, once again, going for a fake kickoff. This time it's Mozzarella that comes away with the favorable position. Nico just can't get the clear out to the side or away from his opponent. So Mozzarella... Takes another lead. Mozzarella extends the lead to two. And that should push us to game five. Or maybe not. Hold on. Hold on. Four seconds left. What does Nico have in his bag of tricks? It is a standard kickoff. But he's kept it alive. He'll have a full tank of boost. Mozzarella not going to let him have a chance. We go to game five. Oh, that got away from him, Mozzarella. Not the perfect setup. 
But he made something out of it. Now Nico, hoping for that boost spawn, doesn't get it. He does have half a tank here. He'll send it to the side. Mozzarella shot. Lacks. Lacks a bit of power. Back and forth thus far. No one really... No one really willing to do what it takes. <laughs> Just... Oh, <laughs> I say no one really willing to take the risk that it may require to score a goal, but Nico will just bully Mozzarella out of the way as the ball rolls in. That is that is ratty. That's exactly what that is. That is ratty. Wow, Nico got the boost there. Mozzarella has to be careful. He does well to avoid the demo. Now he's earned himself a possession. Oh, very nice. Mozzarella knew there was a moment of weakness. When he got that backflip flick, Nico is actually, he's done well to hover in a good position. He had the direct shot cut off, but Mozzarella was actually one step ahead. No direct shot. He sends it off the crossbar to force an own goal. Good setup. Mozzarella holds the dodge. And the fake is effective. That's an all-in play for Mozzarella. Good 50, though. He can keep it alive. Early reset for Mozzarella. Once again, holds that dodge to the final moment. That is very well done. You can see this wave dash catch. Sends it to the far side. Beautiful precision. Delay kickoff from Maza. Nico has no boost in the tank there. A flick to the far side. It will test Mozzarella on defense. But he's passed the test. Has both of his corners stolen. Nico's going to take all the boost. Mozzarella wisely begins to path over the pads. Wow. Mozzarella greedy decision making there. He wanted that corner boost. But Nico... I mean, quite greedy from Nico as well, to be honest. Neither of the players wanted to play the ball when I think both probably should have. Oh, no. Mozzarella just caught in no man's land. Nico will get a third. Nico's shot is on target. Mozzarella 
Stretches. He's able to make the save. Now Nico. Another shot on target, but Mozzarella again. With the save. Now he's heading the other direction. Reset. Oh! Look at that! You know, he just continues to save it until the final moment. Has a couple different options. And this time he goes for the ground pinch to the far side. He's got a fourth. Forty-five seconds left, and Mozzarella is in a great position for the reverse sweep. Fake kickoff. Earns himself full tank of boost and possession. He's run some time off the clock, and that looks like it's actually on target. Nico back in plenty of time, and now he's got a chance from the left wall. Reset. It's on target. Blocked away by Mozzarella, and that will probably do it. 20 seconds left. Mozzarella, shot is no good, but he maintains possession. GG's. A reverse sweep for Mozzarella. And we get one for the road here from Nico. He's doing laps around the arena. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Not too fast. All right, now we hand off. Okay, Nico's done. GG's. Mozzarella will take it in five.